act like we're on vacation. Go stand next to that old gentleman. I want a shot of you with the town in the background. Okay, sure. lady. I'll even give you a title for the shot. A city boy. Moments before he got eaten by a bear. Hi. Hello there. You picked a good time to visit our town. Deerfest is just two weeks away. Deerfest, huh? Did you hear that, honey? You have a lovely wife. If you don't mind me saying. I'm Pat Maine, by the way. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I'm Alan Wake. I won't pretend I don't recognize a famous writer such as yourself, Mr. Wake. A pleasure. I'm an avid reader myself. I hope this isn't too presumptuous of me, but I'm the night host of the local radio station. Any chance to get involved? Look, Mr. Maine, I'm on vacation. In fact, I'd appreciate it if we could keep my being here just between the two of us. I'm sure you understand. Fair enough. You can trust me to be this. Not a hard man to track down if you change your mind, though. I hope you two have a lovely holiday. Welcome to take two of my attempted at recording at nice. <laughs> Alan Wake. I got a couple of really good ones. So you made a friend. That's cute. Right. And I say take yeah. two, but. Bestseller? That's my favorite writer. Are you there yet? Very. Yeah. We just got. It. Are the locals giving you trouble? Just say the word and I'll hop on a plane and come make sure that you're left alone, Al. No, Barry, we're fine. Great. Oh, Great. No. I just want to make sure you do. Nom nom. Apple. Hello, my apple. Nom nom. Barry, we're just settling in. Okay, Al. I'll call back later to make sure you're doing okay. And you call me if there's a problem, okay? Okay. Just looking out for you, buddy. Talk to you later. I love you too. You know he's going to be calling you every five minutes. Barry is Barry. I can always turn off the phone. What did I tell you? Sex message from Barry. He says hi to you too. <laughs> Alan, we're here. Come on, let's get back to the car. I say attempted because the last time I recorded this part, all of my microphone audio was too soft. So I'm going to be re-recording this, and I'm recording the audio externally in Audacity. So I'll be able to turn up the audio we there. We need to stop at the local soft. diner to get the cabin key from the landlord. I'm Mr. Carl Stucky. He's waiting for us. I hope, I hope I don't get a copyright flag for this and I said this in the last video, I really hope I don't get a copyright flag for this. But even if I do, I'm still going to continue the let's play anyway. Thank you for coming oh, I love you too. Go on. No, I'll promise no, to behave. Apple. No, no, no. Mm -hmm. I've forgotten there were still places like this. Towns where everybody knew everybody. Welcome to the Oh Dear Diner. I, I was wondering if you could help me. I'm looking for... Mr. Wake. Alan Wake. Oh, God. I am your biggest fan. I know people say that all the time, but I really am. I'm glad to hear that. Rose. Rose. I'm looking for Mr. Stuckey. Carl Stuckey? Carl? Of course, Mr. Wake. You must have gone to visit the restroom. You'll be back in a moment. <laughs> I can't believe it. I've got all of your books. I got the cut up from the bookstore when they took it out of the window. And you keep it here. Well, okay. Good for you. Do me a favor, Send it Fango. I could really use a tune right now. Coconut number six in the jukebox. I do it myself, but both of my legs have gone to sleep. <laughs> nice guy, this guy. Yeah. Are you serious? Coconut again? You disgust me. Call yourself a <laughs> This one hit a mean look. There yeah, used to be a thermos here, but I took it already. It. A collectible thermos. Don't go in there. You can hurt yourself in the dark. I think I can handle it now. I didn't want to wait. I wanted to find Stucky to get the key and get out as soon as possible. The waitress was giving me a headache. Overeager fans always did. Yep, overeager fans. Hello? <sighs> Mr. Stucky? Where did you come from? Carl couldn't make it. Unfortunately, he was taken ill. But I have the key for you and instructions on how to get to the lane. Okay. I wish you a good stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in. 
and to meet your wife. I insist. I hate you, scary woman. I hate you, I hate you, I hate you, I hate you, I hate you. I really, really, really hate you. I dislike you. Cauldron Lake is a special place. Very inspiring. Let's get back into the light where it's not so scary. Yeah. Even that sounds better than your singing. Are you alright? <laughs> the Andersons, they're uh, local musicians. We're waiting for Dr. Hartman to come pick them up. I'm just gonna skip all of this because I have heard it before. <laughs> I'm sorry to make this a short video, but hey, I just want to get back to the part where I was playing it so I can, you know, continue on. My hero. I got some flashlights, just in case. I'll try not to talk during the cutscenes, but then I don't hey, know where they're. Mrs. Wake! Your... Your keys! Whoops. That diner was a real nut house. <laughs> Can you believe this place? This would make a wonderful setting for a book. We're supposed to be on vacation, Alice. I'll figure it out when we get back home. This okay. is still a very pretty game. Okay. We can talk about this later. Batman here on PBFF. I didn't want to talk about it. I wanted to bury my head in sand. Here's another one of my favorites to go with. Once upon a time, I was a successful writer, but that was a long time ago. I hadn't been able to write a word in two years, not since my last book. And now the weather. It's going to be a clear night, so folks in the big city might want to look up every once in a while. Music, 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 music. Um, 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 um. Copyright, copyright, copyright. Copyrights, 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 copyrights. There, better. <laughs> Oh gee, I wonder why they call it Diver's Isle. I'll get you inside safe and sound before it gets dark. And I've got the flashlight. Alice had a phobia. The fear of darkness. I wanted to make sure we were inside with the lights on before sunset. So many ravens. I'm gonna ignore everything in the house because I know what's there. Freaky, friggin' jump scary, friggin' picture, friggin' hate jump scares for him. The island had once been the site for a love story. Maybe it would be that again. Boop. An old generator had been connected to the power cable. Start. Start! The last time I... I pranced around this freaking shed for like two minutes trying to figure out where the door was. <laughs> No, no, don't look around, Alan. Don't look around. No, I know what comes next. Oh, no. It was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here, sleep here, and forget about my work. I thought we could be happy here. You thought, clearly, you thought wrong. Okay, back to the house. Where is she all? Do, 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 do. Is she a lot homely now with all the lights on? Honey? Alan, I'm upstairs. I have a surprise for you. You have a surprise for me? <gasps> Pants! And the immediate male instinct! <gasps> a typewriter. Surprise. Alice, what is this? I guess I have a small confession. I thought maybe you could write here. That a change of scenery would get you lost. Dad, Alice, Mom. you, everyone. Hey, keeps... hey, hey! Just hear me out. There's a local doctor, Doctor Hartman. I read a book of his. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping artists. Maybe so now you want to get me committed? No, it's not like that. That's not. <gasps> Lady. Alan? Alan? 
Lady. I don't, just don't. I don't want to hear it. God damn it, Alice. Lady. God damn it. I knew she wouldn't follow me in the dark. I needed some time alone to think things through. <sighs> lady. That lady. Ow. Alice. This game is a very bright game. My eyes. Alice! <gasps> Alice, 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 Alice! And here we go again. Keep going. <laughs> I don't like this game. I'm gonna go turn the volume down now. <laughs> Waking up in the crash car. Felt like I had woken from one nightmare and entered another. I couldn't remember how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. Here comes the part of the game that I detest. Uh, where do I have to go again? I'm not gonna look at the book because, you know. Oh, oh, excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. The gas station was my best bet. They'd have a phone I could use. It looked like a long hike through the forest to get there. Long hike through the forest and a lumber mill full of evil people. <laughs> Damn. Well, there goes the car. Bye, car. Right, let's ignore that and let's go this way. Just need to quickly catch up on all the time I lost. I spent half an hour recording this yesterday, but to find out all my mic volume was too low, it's too soft, friggin' uh, uh, My eyes. Hello? Someone there? Manuscript pages. Collectibles. The loose sheets of paper were pages from a manuscript entitled Departure. That was the name I planned to use for the next novel I had never gotten started. I was named the author. I hadn't written it. I couldn't remember writing it. In the scene on the page, the hero was attacked by an axe murderer in the woods at night. Carl Stucky! Ooh! <laughs> I have a lot. I have a lot of these pages. My mouse cursor is still missing, but oh well. Never mind. That's that's a thing that I can't avoid. So let's move on. There's gonna be a silhouette at the top of this hill. There's gonna be another jump scare. There it is. Not a jump scare, but a atmospheric thing. It's gonna disappear. Oh look, there's a light. Ooh, I wonder what that light could be. Oh, it's a lumber mill. Wonderful. The lights up ahead were a good sign. Maybe I wouldn't have to hike all the way down to the gas station to find a phone. La 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 la. Oh yes, there is nothing in this box. I checked already the last time I came here. There is nothing in that box. No need to check. Anybody there? Hey! Hey, you! Phil! There's been an accident! I need help! Listen, I need to... Cabins for rent in... Oh, hell. Carl... Stucky! Pleased to meet you. non reservation deposit required. Fair and square! Fair and square, Mr. Allen. Mr. Wake. Fair 
and squirrel. Eat manuscript paint. I saw I had that one before, but oh well, let's get it again. Whoop! Ow! Okay, oh that actually hurt me. <laughs> Run 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 run! It is tank. And here comes the reference you will see coming. Any second now, and Stucky would be knocking on the door with his axe like Nicholson in The Shining. I love Stephen King. I think you realize that by now. I love Stephen King. Things 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 things. Well, they're good at telephone lines. And something else is gonna happen too. Uh oh. Quick! Purge the darkness, purge the darkness, purge the darkness, purge the darkness, not working! Get out of the thing, Alan, get out of the thing! Ooh. Bye! Right, this way, this way we go. Uh oh, and people, dark people. Come on, 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 come on. Ah, good. I didn't, I didn't nail that dodge right. Back here, we'll find a supply case with a flare gun. Useful. Mainly because there's uh, another encounter coming up ahead that has three people instead of two. And then we gotta go this way. Nope, tab, go back around the other shoulder, please. Thank you. <laughs> Kick this to disable the electric fence. And the then you climb the over. Last place I wanted to go, but I had no choice. I had to get to the gas station. Oh, 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 oh. This guy again. And now that I know where these guys are coming from, it's gonna be a bit too easy. <laughs> then there's another manuscript page. Yep. Yeah. Although I've, I think I've collected it already, so it won't actually show up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually saw it already, so. It's not gonna turn up as a new one. Avoid the electrical wire. Continue on down this way. Whoops. I just made my game volume a bit. Okay, yeah, that's why I don't put my game volume a bit higher. <laughs> At least my ears are gonna get blown out by that. <laughs> I hate that. I really do. What the hell was that? 